Hello gamers and gamettes, what is going on? My name is Tanek127 and welcome back to another Rogue Company video. And before we get into today's video guys, just want to do my shameless plugins. If you're not, just make sure you're following me on all appropriate social media for more news on games and stuff like that, like Rogue Company and other titles that I cover here on the channel. And let's go ahead and get right into today's video. So, um, what's going on guys? Um, one thing that has come to my attention been on my mind for a long time and something I see asked of me frequently and others. I see it on Twitter and I definitely see it in my YouTube comments a lot. Where is the Rogue Company Alpha for the Nintendo Switch? And um, that's a good question and I'm going to do my best to answer this question today. Now I do want to um, disclose a few things. I am a Rogue Company Alpha tester. I have played Rogue Company on all platforms that the Alpha is currently available on right now, which is obviously all the ones mentioned, but Nintendo Switch. I'm not allowed to talk about anything gameplay-wise. I can't even tell you guys if I enjoy the game at this current time. Rogue Company is in an Alpha state and expected to go into a closed beta sometime in summer of 2020 with a launch sometime later on in 2020. Now, um... Now that we got those uh, those little credentials out of the way, I do I am going to take some time to just talk about you know information that I've seen out there, public stuff without breaking my NDA or anything, and um, also you know things that I just know from personal experience dealing with Nintendo, working with um, developers, with um, playing certain games and stuff like that, and I'm going to try and make as much sense of this mess as I possibly can. So over the past several months, I'm sure everybody's noticed due to the giveaways on Twitter and stuff like that, from the, especially from the Rogue Company Twitter, the Rogue Company Alpha is out there. Um, if you look hard on YouTube, there are a bunch of knuckleheads who break NDA regularly all the time. There's plenty of gameplay out there to be seen. There's a gameplay trailer. There's a couple gameplay trailers actually out there for this game now. And um, I'm just saying, seeing Rogue Company gameplay isn't a difficult thing to do. Getting your hands on a Rogue Company Alpha Key right now during early summer of 2020 really isn't a hard thing to do. Every time I turn around, that Twitter's doing a giveaway. So if you're not following Rogue Company on Twitter, go do that. I guarantee you, you'll get yourself a key within a week or two of following that Twitter or join their Discord or something. Like I, like I said from the beginning with when it comes to high-res games, they are very gracious with getting people into their alphas. They want people to play these. Trust me. Um, but like I said, there's really not much information on Switch out there. Well, I'm here to tell you guys that there actually is. The thing with Nintendo is Nintendo just has more strict rules when it comes to alpha and beta tests. I'll put it you guys like this. I am a Switch owner and I've owned one for over a year. Since I've had... Nintendo Switch for over a year. I've played tons of multiplayer games, games that should have had beta tests and alpha tests, and they probably would have performed a lot better. Out of all these multiplayer games I have played, only two of them have had betas. And these developers, from what I know, had to go through hell and high water to even get a beta on this platform. These two betas were a game called Ninjala and another game called Viger that's on Xbox One. These are the only two betas I've ever played on Nintendo Switch, and that's because they have really strict policies with alpha tests and beta tests. And if they're that strict with betas, I can only imagine how strict they are with alphas. Now, first and foremost, I do want you guys to know that the official Rogue Company Twitter has actually spoken up on the Switch Alpha one time thanks to myself and another good friend of mine named Switch Shooter Games. I'll show you guys a tweet right here. They said, we aren't able to publicly discuss alpha plans, but there will be an alpha for the Switch before all platforms enter closed beta. And I'll put it to you guys like this, the closed beta is supposed to happen sometime summer of 2020. So that means the Switch alpha is less than a month or two away, because summer will be ending around August. So I would, I would assume that the Switch alpha would come out sometime in july that's probably you know my my most reasonable guess there's no guarantee for that but there's not sure now people want to see the switch alpha for multiple reasons they want to know what the game plays like they want to know how it plays on switch they want to know how it looks on switch and things like that well another thing i want to tell you guys is what if i were to tell you that there's already switch gameplay out there 
Yeah, I know. That sounds kind of crazy, right? Since the Switch has been the most hidden version of this game, or so it seems, since day one. Well, you guys have to remember something. The Nintendo Switch version was the one debuted at a Nintendo Direct. Rogue Company was originally marketed as a Nintendo Switch title at, N- at one of Nintendo's Directs last year, I believe in October or November. And it was um that's where Rogue Company made its big debut and announcement and all that stuff and and you know sign up for the alpha. That's one reason I'm finding it really important to get information out there to Switch users because you know it's like hey they showcase the game at a Nintendo show but yet everyone's playing the game but Nintendo. I know seems kind of messed up. I've brought this up numerous times. I think that's kind of why the Rogue Company um community manager went ahead and decided to you know to provide some type of answer because you know me and Switch shooters put that that notion out there you guys did originally announce this game at a nintendo thing well there used to be another community manager for rogue company um a few months back his he went by the name of watermelon on twitter he's from according to his twitter description he's currently not with high res anymore so i doubt he has information on the game but i also had a tweet from his in an older rogue company video mine i'm gonna put up here where he clarifies that a certain trailer actually was showing 60 fps Nintendo Switch gameplay, and not to mention High Res Scott also during the um, the High Res Expo event last year had no problem taking pictures, screenshots, and showing off the Switch version being played at High Res Expo. So there's a lot of gameplay and screenshots of the Switch version out there already, which is um a pretty a um a a pretty cool thing, and most people don't even don't even realize it but i'm going to go ahead and play this trailer for you guys now this gameplay trailer is straight from nintendo switch now remember this is from last year this is an alpha test so what you see here is subject to change but like but if you guys have played any high-res game on switch before you know they all run really good at 60 fps on unreal engine 3 on the switch rogue company is an unreal engine 4 game so you can only imagine what this looks like here take a peek And yeah, that's what Rogue Company looks like on the Nintendo Switch. Im- impressive, huh? Well, at least according to you know to to their post. And if you look at you know the picture from from High Res Scott and everything like that posted from HRX last year, I find this gameplay you know very very believable. And not to mention this is the trailer that was debuted at the Nintendo Direct, so it would make sense for them to showcase a trailer showing Nintendo Switch gameplay of the game. But anyway, guys, I just wanted to let you Switch users know that, you know, there is hope. Um, the Rogue Company Alpha will be coming soon to Switch. They're just, you know, they, they probably have to be hush-hush about it and work behind the scenes and do some different things to meet Nintendo's standards and stuff like that. But trust me, guys, it'll be out there. And like I said, I'm not I'm not allowed to talk about gameplay or anything like that as an alpha tester. I'm officially under NDA. But trust me, it's worth the wait. I promise you. But anyway, guys. If you all enjoyed this video and this video helped you today, be sure to smash that thumbs up button for me. Make sure you share this with a friend that's waiting for the Switch version. Hopefully this will, you know, provide some clarity and give you some insight on what's going on with the game. And I want to thank you all so much for watching. It's your boy, Tenek127. And please don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and I will see you guys in the next video. Till next time, peace out. Take care.